If you've never considered how a needle and thread could change one person's life, this group of women might make you think twice. We always pray for the homeless, but sometimes prayer is not enough and you need to actually get out there and help them. Sewing sleeping bags is an act of compassion toward the more than 200 homeless men, women, and children in Smith County. In a small way, that's what we're doing, is that we're recognizing people um, for their humanity. St. Veronica's compassionate sewers find their inspiration from the woman who offered her veil to Christ before his crucifixion. She came up and she sees Jesus walking, you know, carrying this cross, and she saw underneath that deformation of the of all the torments that he had had and she saw a human being. Some volunteers like Shauna Tankersley are pros. I worked in a sewing factory when I was in high school sewing dresses and whatever and then I just have been sewing all my life. Others are here to learn. When I got here I said oh Lord do you think we can finish one blanket today? <laughs> Every blanket starts with picking the right fabric. Most of it is donated, just scraps from cleared out collections or unfinished projects. From there, it moves to measuring and cutting the material, steps simplified by instructions and templates. We needed um, people to do the ironing so that we could press the seams. It's easier to sew when they're pressed. A layer of mylar helps keep the moisture out and the body heat in. The techniques can be challenging. My needle would sometimes get stuck and we would have to do just a little work around. Um, the thread broke several times because it was so thick and so had to re-thread and refill the bobbin tons. The only real requirement is a servant's heart. One heart, one mind, one spirit. I think this blanket is formed within that love. All the while, these ladies keep a prayerful focus on loving those who sometimes feel forgotten. Then that's leaving it in the Lord's hands, and, and then he can, we, we trust in him to do what he can do with what we've done. Lane Lucky, East Texas News Weekend.